10, 15 years ago, we started converting some tillable ground into grassland with some warm season grasses. And as recent as two years ago, we converted tillable ground into grass again with a warm and cool season, different paddocks that we're gonna use more for our spring calving. We do a lot of cover crops. We've also done several tree plantings with uh, riparian buffers through NRCS. Our riparian buffers are low grounds or streams that are headed to the Big Sioux River. And what we're doing is planting grasses and trees on the edges of them and making them wider to make that buffer strip bigger to help filter the water for better water quality. Sioux Rural Water is our water supplier for our farm and for our towns around here. And we have some of the cleanest water in the state. Some of their pump stations are within miles of our farms and we have riparian buffers right alongside of there. And I think that helps the water quality, the grasslands versus the tillable grain operations and the commercial fertilizers. The grasslands do a better job of filtering and making our water better. What I envision and what I would like to see for my son and my son's son someday is that the grasslands are still here. I have two U.S. Fish and Wildlife grasslands easements that are permanent, perpetual easements that that grass is never going to be broke up. It's always going to be here for my kids and uh, generations to come. And I think that is is a great program to ensure that we are still going to have a place for our cattle, a place for our wildlife, to keep things in balance.